agreement. But when uh, Putin's not taking his phone calls anymore, and I think that's because he's saying, uh, you know what, I see what you're doing to me. I'm not going to let you set up. I'm going to make you look like a jerk uh, by not taking your calls. And I'm just going to call all your NATO friends in Europe and remind them what they're getting themselves signed on to. And, uh, and Glenn Beck is a Judas goat. <laughs> well, give this man a, a cigar. You just quantified everything I've tried to say in an hour. You line up all the global crises. The Rand Corporation said two years ago they want a world war as a reset. It's the only way the elite can stay in power. They've committed so many crimes, gotten us in so much debt. They may do it just to distract everyone and get their world government set up. And yeah, I mean, Hitler and Stalin divided Poland secretly. Uh, the powers at the end of World War II, Stalin and the, and the, and, and the U.S. divided Germany. The Allies show that could be going on, but it doesn't have the, the signs of that. I agree. It, it looks real. So I, I, man, I tell you, you just pointed out all the points, though. Thank you, sir. Alex Jones here to tell you about how you can help spread liberty worldwide while also enjoying what I have found to be the best tasting 100% organic coffee on the planet. For more than a decade, my favorite coffee has come from the high mountains of southern Mexico where the Chiapas farmers grow their unique shade-grown Arabica beans. We have now managed to secure the sought-after beans in a highly customized blend. Discover and try a bag of the Patriot Blend 100% organic coffee at InfoWarsLife.com. This coffee gives gives you a long, smooth pick-me-up for hours without the headaches and heartburn that so many other coffees give me personally. Hands down, this is my favorite coffee. And it's taken us years to secure connections directly to the Chiapas Mexican farmers. Drop by the site today, order a bag or two, and I don't think you're going to be disappointed. Available in original or with our immune support infusion blend, you will be supporting a free press, all the while enjoying a truly great-tasting cup of my favorite coffee. Available at InfoWarsLife.com. The globalists have controlled the mainstream media for a long time, but now they're expanding and making the weaponization even more vicious and deceptive. All the major networks are state-run. We are partnering this year with the NFL. The NFL has become a political weapon against the Second Amendment and pushes Obamacare. MSNBC tells us that our children belong to the state. We have to break through our kind of private idea that kids belong to their parents or kids belong to their families and recognize that kids belong to whole communities. It is more important than ever to realize that we are not the alternative media. We are the true media. The establishment dinosaur press is dying. We are in an information war, and we are losing that war. Join us at InfoWarsNews.com and PrisonPlanet.tv. Members can share their memberships with up to 11 people. By subscribing, you will literally be buying war bonds in the info war to expand our operation in the face of the tyrants. Join us at PrisonPlanet.tv. A chemical spill contaminating the water supply in nine West Virginia counties. This year alone, over 300,000 people in West Virginia had their drinking water contaminated. What are the health effects of having these drugs in our drinking water? It's forced medical treatment without the consent of residents. My friends, water filtration is one of the most basic actions you can take to protect you and your family from the harmful toxins and heavy metals in your tap water. On average, the county says it sprays with the glyphosate at least once a week. Few filters cut out the glyphosate that is found in water supply worldwide. Remove pesticides, herbicides, chloramines, hydrofluorosilicic acid, sodium hexafluorosilicate. Fluoride, it is in tea, it's in coffee, it's in water, it's in bread, it's in toothpaste. It is our responsibility to protect our families. The establishment's not going to do it. It's time to take action. It's time to filter our water. Visit InfoWarsStore.com and use promo code WATER to get 10% off their entire family of incredible products. Or call toll-free 888-253-3139. Why does the United States spend the largest percentage of GDP in the world on health care? Why do we have the highest cancer rates on the planet? The highest rates of diabetes, autism, and every other major disease. It all comes down to one thing. We are what we eat. Our food is devoid of nutrition and processed with poisons and additives. Our water is filled with toxic poisons and big pharma runoff. All of this has been engineered by design. We can turn the tide against 
the eugenicist by giving ourselves the nutrients our body desperately needs. To learn more, visit InfoWarsHealth.com. The site is literally packed with audio and video featuring top health professionals who don't bow down to Big Pharma. The fight against the New World Order starts with you, and you can't stand against the machine if you're sick, tired, and obese. When you visit InfoWarsHealth.com, be sure and check out the catalog with nearly 400 life-changing products and get free shipping when you sign up for auto ship. Coast to coast, direct from Austin. You're listening to the Alex Jones Broadcasting Network. Network. Crashing through the lies and disinformation, it's Alex Jones on the GCN Radio Network. Radio, 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 radio. Radioactive. Monday through Friday, 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. Central. We have the weekday transmission. And find all the free podcast, audio, video feeds, InfoWars.com. The free iPhone app, all of it at InfoWars.com, PrisonPlanet.com. Follow us on Twitter at Real Alex Jones. And then we come back Sundays. Here we are live, 4 to 6 p.m. Central. I'm going to go right back to your phone calls into the next segment. But then I've got to get into all this economic news, police state news, electricity news. Get ready for your power prices to go up thanks to a U.N. treaty. That's all coming up. But... It's almost gotten, not annoying, but a hindrance. But I shouldn't be upset about it because it's a great sign. I went out last night to eat dinner downtown and to see a movie and do some other stuff. And I'm not exaggerating. I probably was stopped by 30 or more people that wanted to take photos with me or shake my hand or whatever. And I'm not bragging, hey, people know who I am. I could care less about that in and of itself. It's that liberty is popular. And most of them will just look at me and say, man, I used to watch you when I was in college at UT 15 years ago, and I thought you were nuts, and now it's all public. Or, man, I used to think you were a kook. Let me buy you a drink. Everything you said's true. Just over and over and over again. Because sometimes I'd walk by people on the street and they'd say, hi, Alex, like your show. But other times people would laugh at me or go boo or point their finger. A minority of folks, but that never even really happens anymore. They'll walk over and go, man, I thought you were crazy. It's all coming true. The reason it's all coming true is it was already going on at certain levels beneath the surface. The corruption is so big now, it's out in the open. And a lot of people are awake. Congress has a 6% approval rating. 9% is the highest it goes. I mean, that's an illegitimate government. Obama's illegitimate. He's a criminal. And we've got to call them out for what they are. I mean, the website for Obamacare never worked on purpose. It turns out none of the idiots that think they signed up really signed up. You go to Walmart now, they got like a robot kiosk that tells incredibly healthy people they have diabetes and sign up for Obamacare. I mean, we played clips of that. Jakari Jackson's got like 2% body fat, no health issues, runs almost every day, lifts weights. He goes to Walmart and tells him he's over, overweight and sick. You know, the, the robot to sign up for Obamacare. And all it is is an insurance company robot. You're just signing up to pay overpriced insurance and to have your name put in a database. I don't want to argue with Obama supporters about what a screw job this is. If you want to believe it's a good deal, go ahead and believe it. If you want to believe that I'm a liar, th then just believe it, okay? I'm not a liar, okay? I'm telling you the truth. Let's go to John in Wisconsin. Then we'll uh, go to Donna and a bunch of other folks that are holding. John in Wisconsin, thanks for calling in. What's on your mind today, sir? You said retired vet. You want to give us your take on the Russia situation? Yeah, I think Putin had a um, lightning bolt hit him back when they were having their G8 in Russia. Just from the body um, style between the two leaders and stuff like that. And I think that one or two things, either he knew that we weren't going to help him out, or he knows that there's not going to be any interference by the United States. 
And uh, I think what he's doing, he's getting his people back to recreate the sovereignty that Russia used to have to go against the globalists. Because he knows that it's it's a dead end street. No matter what you do, you can sign on one of them if you want to, but in the end, the only same 12 families are going to be in control of everything. And the globalists want to exterminate most of the population. The Russians pay you to have kids. Their top TV host on state-run media, literally, I've been invited on the show, and just I'm not doing it. I'm not going on there. But the point is, talks about the New World Order, talks about cancer, viruses, and vaccines. And I know the Russian government listens to my show. I'm not romanticizing. I'm not even saying they're good. But I'll say compared to the globalists that are eugenicists, Putin doesn't want five-year-olds being taught how to be gay or how to masturbate like they want to with the Department of Education here. And so we are so corrupt that somebody like Putin looks good compared to our leadership. I think that's what you're trying to get at here. Yep, that's for sure. And not only that, I was watching Fox Friday night, and I really don't like O'Reilly all that much. I really don't like him now because he was sitting there in his best monarchy, monotone voice, you know, the teacher in class and that and told everybody why uh, Bundy was, you know, wrong. Oh, you so, know, he, uh, I, 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 yeah, no. I know. Yeah. I issue and the, uh, the Patriot issue, the whole thing, you know. Well, so he was demonizing the whole Bundy situation in Nevada? Yeah, and he was slapping down at some of his cult people on Fox News who were supporting him, like um, Hannity. Hannity on that. Yeah, no, I, I I read about that. I didn't see it. I appreciate your call. Yeah, I mean, here's the deal. Let's let's just say Bundy's a horrible racist, the, the uh, Nevada rancher, which he's not. The full unedited video has come out where he said that, you know, he cares about black folks and Hispanics and that Hispanics are super hardworking. We basically need to legalize the illegals. I mean, he actually sounds like like Jeb Bush or something in the full video. Uh, he was talking about how they've replaced one form of slavery with another. And now it's like, oh, let the feds uh, point guns at people and come and take the property. Let the feds raise grazing rights cost up so high that it bankrupted the other 52 families. This is about a federal government that has 90% of Nevada expanding itself. It's about citizens with feds with attack dogs attacking them and snipers saying, if you protest, we will arrest you or shoot you on video. And the American people saying no to the Tiananmen Square type situation. I don't care if the guy that stood in front of the tanks in Tiananmen Square in 1989 was a racist, not a racist, Chinese, German, Jewish, Mexican, I admire the tank man that stood in front of the tank. You know, that iconic image. And then that's a cropped photo. You pull back, there's like 15 tanks backed up because of him. The same thing happened out there. So they're desperate. What do they play? The race card. Meanwhile, we're being signed on to 1.5 quadrillion in global derivatives that's not our debt. We're being signed on to globalism, NAFTA and GATT. The plan is deindustrialize America to make us dependent on government. Here's the LA Times headline. U.S. electricity prices may be going up for good. Experts warn of growing fragility as coal-fired plants are shut down, nuclear power reduced, and consumers switch to renewable energy. How are they going to conquer America? Turning our power off. We're going to go to break, and I'm going to rampage and talk to Donna and like 10 other callers. I'm going to give each caller about a minute, and I'm done with calls. Final segment, I'll cover uh, this other news uh, also, the Mark scientist claims human microchip implant will become not optional. Yeah, that's the big push. Uh, that's coming up. We're not in Kansas anymore. Briefly, don't forget, we're listener supported. We don't take money like NPR from banker bailout money or stimulus money or, or like uh, MSNBC. We are supported by you. Great products at great prices at InfoWarsStore.com. Hi folks, Alex Jones here with some important information. I want to tell you about Matt Redhawk and his team of patriots over at My Patriot Supply. Several years ago, Matt was sitting in his two-bedroom apartment, frustrated with the direction this country was headed, and the charlatans willing to sell us out for a quick buck. 
deciding to take action. A company run by Patriots for Patriots was born. My Patriot Supply has never taken a loan or accepted outside funding. They now operate two distribution facilities and employ over 50 hardworking American men and women. It is rare to find companies who practice what they preach. And that's why I stock my pantry with high quality storable foods from My Patriot Supply. Go to mypatriotsupply.com forward slash Alex today for special offers on emergency food storage or call their preparedness specialist at 866 229 092